Hey everybody, this is the Cody Queen coming at you. Hope you all had a good day. Well, it looks like opensubtitles.org has now been fixed. So again, if you're an old fart like me, we really need our subtitles. I may be an old fart, but you know what? I'm a fun old fart. I'm a liberal old fart. There's not a lot of old farts who could say that. However, let me go ahead and teach you. I just made a video the other day because it wasn't working. They want you now to register on their website one time, and I'm going to show you how to do that. So this way you could always get their opensubtitles.org. I think they're one of the most reliable uh, subtitles out there. So let me show you how what you want to do. I would say go to Google, type in right here, opensubtitles.org. It's important. It's not .com, it's .org. It's just a little bit easier than typing it in up here because uh, you go ahead and click right into the registration site. This registration is absolutely for free. You want to go ahead and agree to the 482 pages that only attorneys understand. We don't even know what we're agreeing to, but if you want to get in for free, you got to click on it. So this is very simplistic. This is how you register on every site. You come up with a username and you have to do an email. So I want to stop here. Uh, OpenSubtitles.org will send you a confirmation email with a link in it that you must click to prove that your email is legit. So don't try and put a fake email because you won't be able to get in. So again, they're going to send you a, a confirmation link e email. Uh, mine came within five seconds. Click that. Once you're done with the registration uh, process, you're totally kosher and we go on to the next step. You add your passwords. You can't default this to any other language. That's it. British, English, and I happen to live in South Florida, so I have to put down Eastern Standard Time, America, New York. Now here, they want to make sure there's not spammers or robots out there, so they want you to complete a little test. They want you to find the words that are corresponding to a car. You're going to drag and drop it. See, I got the word fuel. I'm pressing down on my mouse. Drag it. Let's go with engine and wheel. Once you do that, you're going to hit submit. Now, I'm not going to hit submit because I'm already registered. Once it comes up, it's going to tell you, congratulations, you now have registered for free, and you will be sent a confirmation email. Let's go ahead. Let's go because we only are halfway through of what we have to do. So I'm going to go ahead and close this. Let's assume you um, <clears throat> got your email. You're all confirmed. You're ready to go. Now, I have... I, I have made my own build. Most of you, I'm sure, have the, the uh, what I call the bare-bone version of Kodi, which is probably a very dull-looking uh, uh, screen, blue with those ugly Lawrence Welk bubbles, because I don't know who uses bu bubbles anymore. Uh, I don't even think kids play with bubbles anymore. All right, so yours would probably say system. <clears throat> if you have a build, or at least on my build, it will say settings. They're both the same thing. And we're, and we're going to click on this because no matter if you have a build or not, it's, it's going to be the same exact thing. So we're going to click. We're going to go to add-ons. Then we're going to click. Sorry, I have a step ahead. Then it's going to say my add-ons. You want to click on that. Now, I know most of you, you're going to end up defaulting up here. Most of you are probably used to going down to video add-ons. We're not going to do that. We have to go to subtitles because we have to register. Now, in my last uh, video, which was the other day, I gave you a workaround fix until open subtitles got fixed. <clears throat> I asked you to downgrade your version. Well, now since it's fixed, we're going to go ahead and update it. For those who already have 5.0.16, you don't need to do this. Um, you just kind of have to watch and wait. For those who uh, did what my other video said, which is downgrade, we're now going to go ahead and upgrade it. So we're going to click upgrade. Now here is something really key. If you notice, you do not want to click on that because this is only if you have XBMC. 99% of us have Cody. So you want to click on the second one. If you click on this one, it's not your registration's not going to work. 
So, um, so click on this. It's going to now update it. Just takes a matter of seconds. We're almost done. So we're going to click back because we're not completely done. Now notice I'm on the new version, 5.0.16. Uh, now we could go ahead, turn back auto update. Now here's the part. We want to click on configure. This is now where you put, remember you want to put your username, not your email address, <clears throat> unless you made your username your email address. Put your password in. Now here's the most important thing. Don't rush off. You must click the OK button. If you don't, it's not going to save it. So let's go ahead and click OK. And we're done. Let's go ahead and test it out. All right, so remember, we've updated it to 5.0.16. We've turned back auto update. Okay, we wanted to make sure on the update you hit number two, unless you're using uh, XBMC, which most people out there don't. Let's go hit the back button. We're going to keep going, hitting the back button, keep going back. So let's test it out. So we're going to go to the movies. Okay, so we're going to click over to uh, find the movie section so we could test it. And let's go right here. Now, I, I picked Suicide Squad because I know that there are subtitles. Let's go ahead and click on one of these and start up the movie. And we could go ahead. This is where the subtitle is. You want to click on that. And as you see, open subtitles came up. Here's Suicide Squad, just like the good old days before they made you register. I'm going to go ahead and speed this up so I could show you that there is uh, subtitles. And there you go. All right, for all those who really hate subtitles and it comes on up accidentally, let me go ahead and show you how to take it off. If you want to go ahead, and let me go ahead and do this again, bring up your control panel. You're going to come right down here, and you want to scroll all the way down to enable subtitles. You're going to click it off. Do you notice right here? It's gone. Let's go ahead and click on it again to make the blue button. Come back, and there you go. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I really hope that you have learned how to get your great subtitles back. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.